Okay, today I'm just going to show you, Tim, how to, how to use this hemp and paste. And just to show you, uh, all the threads here in Europe are non-tapered, at least anything that I've ever seen. So you can easily screw everything together by hand. And that's why we use the hemp and paste over here to, give, to fill in that little bit. So I'm just going to take some paste on my finger. and put a little bit on the threads. You don't need you know to fill them completely up, but you do want to put a little bit on there. And I think all the paste does actually is just lubricate more than anything else. Then you take your hemp and I know that your hemp is a little bit different uh, uh, styling than this. This is drawn out a little bit and yours is more of a big a uh, big clump, but the hemp will be three or four feet long, uh, probably what you got, and you need just untie it and then start at one, at one end, and uh, just take a little piece, separate it, where you can work with, and then just kind of pull on a little bit, and we'll just start put put your hemp. About a 45 degree angle. You can leave a little bit extra here on the pipe and then just start at the bottom. Keep keep a little tension on the on it all the time. Keep pulling it out a little bit. Don't worry if it breaks. If it breaks just start uh, wherever it broke and uh, keep coming. And you just pull it right around. You can even go down back down if you want and basically all you want to do is fill in the grooves of the uh, take a little more paste again you don't need a lot but just enough to kind of hold itself down and give yourself a little lubrication Okay, and within just two or three turns, it's already getting too tight for me to turn it. We'll go ahead and make up the, the joint. Okay, and then you'll notice here in the end, it's kind of pushed some of that hemp out and some of the paste out. <clears throat> and you can either, either either leave it like that or just take a simple hacksaw blade <clears throat> or if you've got a little handle for your hacksaw blade like this you can use it too whatever and you just you just go through and begin cutting cutting those ends off so you can see here what we're doing we're just cutting that off Clean it up. And you do that all the way around. And when you get done, you wipe your joint down. And you have a good looking joint and there's no hemp sticking out. So that's the end of the of the lesson. And uh, in the email, I'll, I'll write down a few other little points. Okay. Thanks, Tim. Bye-bye.